mastering data structures and visualizations to supercharge our coding skills. Let's take on the challenge of mastering data structures and visualizations to level up our coding skills. Whether you're building high-performance applications, optimizing algorithms, or just trying to debug that one frustrating bug, understanding data structures can be the game-changer you've been looking for. Data structures and visualizations are the backbone of efficient coding. They determine how we store, retrieve, and manipulate data, and the difference between clean, optimized code and a slow, clunky mess. But here's the real challenge. Many developers struggle to pick the right data structure for the job. How do you choose between an array and a linked list? A stack or a queue? A hash table or a binary search tree? Today, we're not just talking about theory, we're diving into practical strategies, real-world examples, and powerful visualization techniques that will help you write cleaner, faster, and more scalable code. Ready to unlock the secrets of data structures? Let's go! Let's be honest, every developer has been there. You write a piece of code, it runs, but it runs slow. You tweak it, optimize it, maybe even rewrite it, but something still feels off. Nine times out of ten, the problem isn't your logic, it's your data structure. Imagine you're working on a social media app. You need to store user messages in a way that allows for quick retrieval, but also supports easy deletion when a user clears their inbox. Do you use an array, a linked list, or a hash map? Each has its own advantages, but picking the wrong one could mean slow lookups, high memory usage, or frustratingly complex code. Arrays, perfect for storing large amounts of data that need to be accessed quickly. Think of an image editor storing pixels in a grid, every pixel needs to be located in constant time. Linked lists, ideal for dynamic data that requires frequent insertion or deletion, like an undo slash redo feature in a text editor. Trees, essential for hierarchical data, like organizing files in a directory system or implementing an AI decision tree in a game engine. Graphs, used in social networks, route finding applications, Google Maps, and recommendation systems, Netflix, Spotify. If you've ever wondered how LinkedIn suggests connections, it's powered by graph algorithms. Understanding data structures is one thing, visualizing them is another. And trust me, once you start visualizing your algorithms, everything clicks. One of the best tools for this? Graph is. It lets you create dynamic, easy-to-read visualizations of complex structures like trees and graphs, helping you debug faster and optimize smarter. I used to struggle with understanding binary search trees, until I animated them. Watching nodes rearrange in real time as elements were inserted and deleted completely changed my perspective. Suddenly, balancing trees made sense, and I could easily spot inefficiencies in my implementation. Another must-try? Visualgo, an interactive platform where you can watch sorting algorithms, linked lists, and graph traversals unfold right before your eyes. Imagine watching a Dijkstra's shortest path algorithm navigate a city map, dynamically updating as it finds the optimal route. It's one thing to read about it, it's another to see it happen in real time. Let's say you're building an e-commerce platform and need to quickly search through millions of products. If you use a linear search in an unsorted array, it could take forever. But by structuring your data into a binary search tree or a hash table, lookups become lightning fast. Amazon does something similar by optimizing product search with inverted indexing and tree data structures, making sure that when you search for wireless headphones, you get results in milliseconds, not minutes. The moment you truly understand data structures is when you stop seeing them as just storage solutions and start seeing them as problem-solving tools. Imagine compressing massive datasets with tries, optimizing database queries with B-trees, or improving AI models with graph-based learning, this is where the real magic happens. Mastering data structures doesn't just make you a better coder, it gives you superpowers. The ability to turn slow code into blazing fast applications. The power to debug complex problems with ease. The confidence to build scalable systems from the ground up. So, what's your experience with data structures? Have you ever struggled with inefficient algorithms or debugging complex trees and graphs? Let me know in the comments. By the way, if you're excited to explore more, don't miss our videos on the AI revolution and the latest tech trends. I break down cutting-edge topics that will inspire and keep you ahead of the game. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more data science deep dives. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.